Hey guys, it's Curtis from Merch Titans, and in this video, I'm going to give you an overview of our keyword research module. And this module is going to be extremely beneficial once it's done. Uh, so we're still working on it, and we're always improving it, and we're getting more and more data. But as of now, it definitely works, and it's super valuable. But just know that over the coming months, it's going to definitely have quite a few improvements done to it. Anyway, with that being said, we offer two different uh, keyword research modules, one for Google and one for Amazon. And I'll show you both of those in this video. So basically what you do is you enter in a keyword. So for instance, basketball shirts, I'll enter that in and we'll go out to Amazon and we'll pull the top 10 auto suggested keywords, uh, the most important ones that are suggested by Amazon and pull them over here to Merch Titans and we'll also grab Google search volume. And then we have a few little uh, formulas we created to give you different um, pieces of information. So I'll just show you real quick. So basketball shirt, click search. That'll take a few seconds to load up. Okay, and as you can see here, so we just went and grabbed the top 10 auto-suggested keywords based off our root keyword, which is basketball shirt from Amazon and listed it down here. And this is in order by the most relevant. So this one on Amazon, if you type in basketball shirt, the uh, first suggested keyword would be basketball shirts and then basketball shirts for boys and so on. And as you can see, we do have search volume here and this is accurate Google search volume. And the ones that have the NA like this, uh, we do not have data on yet. And we're hoping to continually improve this tool to where we get data on almost every keyword you search. But up here, you can see you have Google uh, cost per clicks. This is generally what people are paying per click for an ad on Google. Over here you have AdWords competition, meaning how competitive it is based off of what people are paying. So the lower this number, it's zero through one. So the lower this number right here, that's still competitive too, but the lower that number, the better. And then this is really cool. So this is the total number of products found on Amazon with that keyword. As you can see, almost every one of these have that uh, listed. And then the Amazon keyword authority over here. So basically what that is, is our it's uh, the total products found on Amazon plus Google search volume. It's like our own little score to determine what the keyword, keyword authority is. Uh, and then we have Amazon, comp Amazon competition score here. So you can see we give you a score. Um, and these are all pretty competitive um, keywords. But that's the gist of how this tool works. It's very, very powerful. And I do recommend you use it. Now I'll show you the same thing with uh, Google. So it works almost the same way. But now we go out and grab the auto-suggested keywords from Google and bring back that information. So let's give it a few seconds to load. And there you go. So now you don't have the Amazon information, obviously, but you do have the Google CPC, AdWords competition, and search volume. But the keywords are definitely different because these are what Google suggests. So I can see right here, basketball shirt quotes, that uh, stands out to me. 490 on the search volume, nobody's paying any money for it in terms of Google clicks and AdWords competition is super low. So that right there is definitely something I would go up into product search and actually expand on further and see what kind of t-shirts there are on Amazon using that keyword. Look at the sales history, so basically the BSR history and the price history. Look at that fluctuation, see if uh, a couple of those top shirts are getting consistent sales. But just like that, to me, that looks like a winning keyword that you could definitely look into further. Anyway, that's how our keyword research module works. It's definitely not done. This module is going to add more things like Etsy and hopefully Redbubble and different things like that as we continue to expand on it. And our search volume database will get bigger and bigger. And yes, this is actual Google search volume. It's accurate information. And we'll continually work with Google trying to get access to their AdWords API and different things like that so that you guys can have all the information you need in terms of keyword research right here inside your Merch Titans dashboard. Anyway, that's it for this video. I will see you guys in the next one.